Over the past decade, the adoption of wireless technology has soared. Wireless is fast and convenient. There's no longer a need to be tied to the wall in order to access the internet or a network. However, wireless connectivity to computer networks exposes organizations to a whole new class of vulnerabilities. Wireless networks often extend their reach outside the facility, which means that unauthorized devices outside the building can connect to the network inside. And once inside, these unauthorized devices can access valuable information and critical resources on the network. Criminals have learned how to use wireless access to steal social security numbers, credit card numbers, and other valuable data. And if criminals have learned how to penetrate wireless networks, so have terrorists. It is imperative that we protect our high-value targets in critical infrastructure. Military bases, power stations, ports, transportation hubs, nuclear power plants, and communications buildings. They are all susceptible to cyber attacks. So how can we defend them? Currently, there are two major ways to detect wireless threats. The first is a wireless intrusion detection system, or WIDS. A WIDS consists of multiple sensors placed around a facility that collect wireless data. These systems are effective, but they are costly and are unable to reach all areas, creating gaps in coverage. Another way to defend wireless networks is to drive around in a car with special equipment and software collecting and analyzing wireless data. You may have heard this referred to as war driving. However, this process is time consuming and requires trained operators and expensive equipment to do the collection. Therefore, war driving is not carried out often enough to catch the wireless intruders who come and go over time. What we really need is someone patrolling the area all day, every day. And as it turns out, someone is already doing just that. The physical security force patrolling the facility around the clock. All we need to do is to enable that force to gather the data that we need and then send it to experts for analysis. This is the principle behind Wildcat. Turn an existing physical security force into a real-time monitoring, alerting, analysis and reporting system for detecting wireless threats. We've taken that special equipment and software and packaged it into a ruggedized box that is installed in the trunk of a vehicle. Attach a magnetically mounted antenna to the roof, turn on the ignition, and with no further effort the vehicle becomes a war driving machine. As the security guard patrols the area, the patrol car automatically collects any wireless data that it finds and sends it back, using the same kind of internet connection as your smartphone, to a central monitoring station. Inside the central station, cyber analysts are viewing the wireless data in real time. As the detections come in, they are analyzed and compared against known patterns of suspicious behavior. If there's a match, an alert is automatically triggered. The analysts can also see if an organization's own staff is using the wireless network in a safe and authorized way. And, more importantly, they can see unauthorized attempts to connect to the network from outside the building. By centralizing the monitoring and analysis of this data, those specially trained cybersecurity analysts can monitor and protect many potential targets simultaneously. As more network information is gathered over time and across organizations, these analysts can see if the same intruder is launching attacks across other organizations in the same area and if there is a pattern to his activities. And when all of this points to a wireless device that is exhibiting suspicious behavior, an analyst can send a message back to the driver telling him where he might find the intruder. Food, water, public health, emergency services, energy, transportation, finance, and communications are all sectors in our nation's critical infrastructure that rely on the safe use of cyberspace. The threats are real, and cyber thieves and terrorists are getting smarter. Wildcat can help hunt down those thieves and terrorists and stop them before they damage the infrastructure on which our country depends.